we can reveal Monday's state budget will commit tens of millions of dollars to begin work on extending the metro train network into Melbourne's booming west. Live to Andrew London Sunshine. Andrew, this will also help pave the way for fast trains to Geelong and Ballarat. Uh, yes, Pete, the money will be used to finalise detailed planning for extra tracks and electrification out to Wyndham Vale and Melton. That will separate the busy suburban stations from the regional lines, uh, adding extra capacity uh, and eventually allowing for the possible introduction of electric high-speed regional trains. Today was a typical morning peak at Tarnit Station. <laughs> Commuters crowded onto some of V-Line's oldest and least reliable trains as the regional rail link struggles to cope with suburban demand. The western suburbs are, are some of the fastest growing parts of the country and certainly in the case of Geelong and Ballarat, they're our fastest growing parts of regional Victoria. Monday's state budget will commit $100 million for detailed development and design of the Western Rail Plan, which will add extra electrified tracks from Sunshine to Wyndham Vale and Melton, allowing for an extension of Metro's suburban services. That alone will mean that uh, lots more people can be moved, and as well as that, the Western Rail Plan will uh, separate Geelong trains from the suburban trains. The project will be planned in conjunction with the Metro Tunnel and Airport Rail Link. It's quite a complex sequence in terms of making sure you get the right lines onto the right connections uh, and the, the idea is that the, generally the first electrification that you do will go into the Metro Tunnel. The plan will also look at express fast rail services to Geelong and Ballarat including potential electrification and new electric regional trains. Looking at ways in which we can get trains faster than 160 kilometres an hour, uh, primarily out to Geelong and then looking at how we can do a very similar thing out towards Ballarat. We know we want to electrify the lines uh, in the western suburbs, get faster rail for Geelong and Ballarat, provide more capacity, more space to get into the city. A business case is expected to be finalised next year. Andrew Lund, Nine News.